To transmit digital data using digital signals, the ones and zeros of the digital data must be converted into the proper physical form. This digital to digital conversion is called digital encoding. So for each data bit like 0 or 1, a certain voltage level like 0 and 5 volts are usually used. The most common types of encoding are NRZL, NRZI, Manchester, Differential Manchester, and Bipolar AMI. These methods, especially Manchester, are mostly used in LANs and telephone systems. This picture shows these five types of encoding. The non-return to zero level or NRZL digital encoding schema transmits one as zero voltage and zero as positive voltage. The NRZL encoding is simple to generate and inexpensive to implement in hardware. The second digital encoding method as shown in part B is non-return to zero inverted or NRZI. This encoding schema has a voltage change at the beginning of A1 and no voltage change at the beginning of A0. The difference between NRZL and NRZI is that with NRZL the receiver must check the voltage level for each bit to determine whether the bit is A0 or A1. But with NRZI the receiver must check whether there is a change at the beginning of the bit to determine if it is 0 or 1. Problem with the Z NRZL and NRZI digital encoding is that long sequences of zeros in data produce a signal that never changes and it is going to make it difficult for a receiver machine to distinguish between 0 and 1. This problem is called synchronization issue. To address the synchronization issue with NRZL and NRZI, the Manchester encoding was developed. With Manchester, each bit has uh, some type of signal change and the synchronization issue is never going to happen. In Manchester, to transmit a 1, the signal changes from low to high in the middle of the interval. And to transmit a 0, the signal changes from high to low in the middle of the interval. The transition is always in the middle, A1 is a low to high transition and A0 is a high to low transmission. 